I wore a watch that belonged to my father to a job interview. When the interviewer saw it, he turned pale. Where did you get this watch? To my surprise, the interviewer was someone unexpected, triggering a series of events that would change my professional trajectory. Among twists and ethical choices, this story reveals how a simple object can be the key to unimaginable challenges. Hello, my friends. I am Linda, and this is the Linda's Stories channel. I hope you enjoy this story. On a sunny morning, a young man named Nicholas woke up with a mixture of hope and anxiety that resonated throughout his entire being. Unemployed for months, he was facing financial difficulties that directly impacted his family life with his wife and young daughter. However, that day seemed to bring a promise of change. Nicholas was about to attend yet another job interview, one that represented more than just a professional opportunity. It was the chance to completely transform the course of his family's life. The dream job, so long desired and coveted, was now within his reach, but it also carried with it the weight of many responsibilities. As he prepared for that decisive moment, the words of encouragement from his wife echoed in his mind, making it clear how this interview transcended the boundaries of a mere job search. Nicholas felt his heart race, not just from the inherent nervousness of an interview, but from the intense hope that this opportunity would mark a crucial turning point for his family's future. Before leaving for the much-anticipated interview, Nicholas carefully placed a watch on his wrist that he had cherished for a long time. It was a precious heirloom from his late father, a man who had faced similar challenges with unwavering courage. The watch worn by time had become more than a simple accessory. It was a lucky charm and a symbolic connection to the wisdom and strength that his father represented. Nicholas set off for the interview with renewed confidence. Upon arriving at the interview location, Nicholas's heart pounded with a mix of nervousness and determination. Entering the room, the sight of other candidates waiting increased the pressure he already felt. The competition was evident and the importance of that opportunity weighed heavily on his shoulders. Even in the face of such competition, he strove to maintain the confidence and composure he had cultivated from the moment he left home. Upon entering the first stage, a spacious and well-lit room, the young man sat down on a chair and waited for the activity to start. After some time, something peculiar caught Nicholas's attention. One of the interviewers seemed to fix his gaze on him more intensely. The interviewer's penetrating expression caused a hint of discomfort and made Nicholas question himself internally. Does he know me from somewhere? He wondered, trying to unravel the mystery behind that insistent look. Uncertainty hung in the air, but Nicholas remained focused on the questions, confident that his experience and determination would speak for themselves. A few hours later, after the first stage, some people, including Nicholas, received the news that they had passed on to the next phase of the interview. The feeling of relief and joy permeated the environment, but the journey was still far from over. Upon entering the room designated for his individual interview, Nicholas felt a mix of nervousness and determination. However, his surprise was immense when he realised that the interviewer before him was the same one who had stared at him earlier during the first stage. The interviewer, whose name was James, maintaining a professional demeanour, greeted Nicholas and began to ask questions that explored his professional experience, his skills and his approach to specific challenges. As the interview progressed, the interviewer, interrupting the usual flow of questions, couldn't help but notice the watch on Nicholas's wrist. With a smile, he broke the professional sequence to offer a sincere compliment. That's a beautiful watch you're wearing, Nicholas. Surprised by the comment, Nicholas gave a grateful smile. Thank you, it holds very special meaning for me, he replied. Curious, James decided to explore a bit more about the story behind the accessory. Where did you get this watch, young man? He asked, his face slightly pale. Nicholas, maintaining his composure, responded, it was a watch that belonged to my father. It's very special to me. He left it to me as a keepsake, and since then I see it as a constant source of inspiration. James, the interviewer, continued the conversation in an informal manner, adding a touch of curiosity to the interview. Has it never crossed your mind to sell it? He asked, referring to the watch that had now become a point of interest in the room. Nicholas pondered the question for a moment, before shaking his head firmly. No, it has never crossed my mind to sell it. This watch has immeasurable sentimental value to me. James nodded, 
understanding the importance of the object to Nicholas. At the end of the interview, well wishes were exchanged, and Nicholas left the room carrying a mix of emotions. The night wore on, and Nicholas was wrapped in the anticipation of a possible turning point in his professional journey, anxious about the unfolding of the upcoming chapters that the interview could bring. The next morning, Nicholas received a call from James, inviting him to come to the company for a more informal conversation. Excited about the possibility of advancing in the selection process, Nicholas promptly headed to the indicated location. Upon arriving there, James began to introduce himself in a more relaxed manner, emphasising his position in the company. Look, Nicholas, I am an important person here and I have decision-making power, he stated, initiating the conversation. I really liked you and our talk. The conversation took a surprising turn when James directly questioned, how much do you really want this position? Nicholas, maintaining his seriousness, promptly responded, I really need this opportunity. It was then that James made an unusual proposal. Look, you want this position very much and I want something you have, your watch. I am a collector and would be very happy to add it to my collection. Nicholas was taken aback by the proposal and James continued, The position can be yours if we make this deal. How much would you sell the watch to me for? James's unusual proposal left Nicholas embarrassed, creating an awkward moment. While surprise was reflected in his eyes, he sought ways to handle the delicate situation. He knew that James's suggestion was out of context and did not align with the integrity expected in a selection process. With skill to navigate the situation without seeming rude, Nicholas maintained his composure and calmly responded, Well, James, I really appreciate the opportunity and the interest in my participation in the team. However, my watch has a very sentimental value to me, and I'm not sure if I'm willing to sell it at the moment. He understood the importance of handling the situation carefully, declining the offer. I need to think more about it, Nicholas added, trying to make it clear that his decision was not related to the sale of the watch, but rather to reflecting on the job offer and the next steps in his career. Upon receiving Nicholas's cautious response, James expressed understanding, assuring that he was willing to wait for his decision. This attitude did not go unnoticed by Nicholas's critical eye, who found the interviewer's stance questionable. Upon arriving home, Nicholas shared the situation with his wife, Sarah. He recounted the details of the unusual proposal and the weight suggested by James. Initially surprised, Sarah pondered over the issue amidst the challenges faced by the family. Nicholas, look, I know how much that watch means to you, but we're going through tough times. Wouldn't it be better to consider selling it? You have so many memories with your father and it's just an object, she expressed, trying to balance the sentimental importance of the watch with the financial hardships they were facing. Nicholas in turn felt the weight of Sarah's words and the sincerity behind her suggestion. The decision wouldn't be easy, as it involved not just an object, but also the representation of his history and values. The dilemma was set, and Nicholas now found himself facing a choice that went beyond the boundaries of a job interview, that night, Nicholas's mind was in turmoil. Desperate to improve his family's situation, he lay down, but his thoughts disturbed his sleep. The doubt about whether or not to sell the watch had become a persistent anguish. His wife, Sarah, had questioned him throughout the day, eager for a decision. Nicholas found no peace in the idea. It was too harsh for him. The next day, while the question continued to hammer in his mind, Nicholas sought refuge in the memories of his father, he recalled moments filled with affection and good teachings. Raised in a simple family but grounded in solid principles, he remembered the times when his father, even in the face of difficulties, remained honest and just. This situation seemed like a test, and Nicholas did not look favourably on using the watch, an object of great sentimental value as a bargaining chip to get a new job. As Nicholas wrestled internally, Sarah continued to push for the sale, blinded by the difficulties they were facing. Her persistence added an additional weight to the decision Nicholas needed to make. Finally, yielding to the pressure of circumstances, Nicholas made the difficult decision to sell the watch. When James called, he sounded desperate, proposing a meeting for the transaction. Nicholas knew he was about to give up not just a material object, but a significant part of his family's history. The time for the meeting arrived, and Nicholas headed towards the arranged location, However, while on his way, something made him stop midway and reflect. An inner voice echoed his father's wise words. 
Sailing through life is like choosing a path. Although the quickest one may seem tempting, it's not always the one that leads us to the right destination. In a surge of conscience, Nicholas decided to call off the sail. He felt that it wasn't the right choice, recognising the watch's importance to someone beyond himself. He pondered the possibility of being unfair to other candidates who also aspired to that opportunity. By making this decision, Nicholas knew he would face his wife's disappointment, but his integrity and his father's teachings outweighed it. On his way home, still with a lump in his throat, Nicholas received a notification on his phone. It was a new email. Intrigued, he parked the car and decided to check the message to understand what could be behind this sudden twist in his journey. As Nicholas absorbed the surprising turn in his quest for opportunities, he opened an email notification that would completely change his perspective. It was a message from another company where he had attended an interview. Reading the words on the screen, a mixture of shock and joy spread across his face. Nicholas found out that he had been selected for a position that not only met his expectations, but paid nearly double the salary of the job James had promised him. The opportunity was entirely unexpected, and Nicholas, who had almost given up waiting for it, felt a wave of gratitude and excitement course through his entire being. The twist in the situation reinforced the idea that sometimes choosing the right path even if more challenging, can lead to unexpected rewards. Nicholas upheld the principles his father had taught him. The legacy of character and integrity his father left behind guided his steps, even after he had departed this world. He understood that despite the difficulties and temptations, following the right path was the foundation for building a solid and true future. Sometime later, Nicholas discovered the truth behind James's empty promises. The position that had been so frequently promised to him was already filled, and it became clear that the interviewer was merely bluffing to manipulate the situation in his favour. Thriving in his new job, Nicholas not only found professional stability, but was also able to provide a new chapter for his family, freeing them from the hardships they previously faced. His heart, now clean and light, reflected not just the success achieved, but the reward of having chosen honesty. If you enjoyed, please give it a like and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment with a number from 1 to 5 to let us know how much you liked the story. Also, watch the video that is currently on your screen. See you soon.